Alright guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up your G27 steering wheel. So this acts like your main hub. So as you can see, as I pull this up, and this is where all your connections go. Okay guys, so here is the gearbox here. And this is connected to your gearbox, and this basically just goes straight in to your steering wheel here, like your main hub. So you just put this in, like so. Just plug that in, and it goes on this side. Not that side, because that's a different one. But we'll get to that part later, that is for your pedals. Then you can just attach this and string it around as far as you want. And then you just plug it in there like so. And that's that done. Alright guys, up next is the pedals. So just put them down there just now. And this is what's connected to your pedals on the end. And this goes on this side, just like the other one. It goes on this side, or the other side. This one can be a wee bit more difficult to get in, but... Surely it will go in, as you can see. Then, once again, you just wrap it around like so, then you connect it there. Okay guys, so a quick recap is that the gearbox is this one here, and the pedals are this one here. Up next is the power. So this turns your thing on, your steering wheel and gearbox and pedals, so this just registers everything, and this goes right here next to your pedals. It's a little bit more difficult to get in, but there we go simply goes in. Then once again, you just wrap it around. This one can be a wee bit more difficult to wrap around because there's loads of wires now starting to build up. And surely, there we go. Done. So it's easy as that. Another thing is, guys, that your steering wheel comes with two of these things. These just sit, simply click onto the back of here and then you can pull them off. Just as simple as that. Well, it's actually this side here. So you just clip on there and that, if you've got a really thin desk, that makes it like easier to clip on because my desk is actually that thick so it's quite thick. So once you have done that, you flip it over. Alright guys, so next you can just move everything into position like so. And you just tighten it up like so here. And you just push them down and turn them like so. And that's them down. And on this one you can tighten them like this. And for extra grip, it has one under here that you can turn. Like, so I'm not sure if you can see it, but that just goes like that. Alright guys, next bit is on to your computer, PC, laptop, whatever it is you use. So you can start this off by plugging your USB in first or not. So basically what we're going to do, I'm going to plug mine in just now. So this is a USB 2.0 I think it is, or 3.0, it's one or the other. But basically like that, and as you can see, it's starting up. Okay, so the next part is going to be on the computer. Okay guys, so here is the next part on the computer. So what you'll need to do is come to your internet, whatever you're using. So I've got Firefox here. And I'll have the link in the description. So this is for your G27 profile. So this just lets you check that everything's working. It tells you what all the buttons are called and all that stuff. So when you come to the page, this is it here. Just choose your OS. So I'm with Windows 8 and your bit, so I'm 34 bit. Then you click download and it will be in your downloads. So you save file, then downloads, it will be downloaded. So I'll just cut this bit out so you don't have to wait. Alright guys, so once it is downloaded, it will be in your downloads. So here it is here for me. Just click on it and it will download. So once it has downloaded here, there we go. That's it done. So we want to accept it. This will be no viruses or anything like that. So here you go. You choose your language. It's got loads here. So obviously I'm English. Next, you have to accept to continue, then done. So you register here, and that's done. It will install it that bit, it's because I've done it previously that it's like that. So if you want to know what like button 22 is and stuff, as you can see, it's the bottom right on your steering wheel. So this one tells you what all of your like buttons and pedals and gears and all that stuff is. If you want to see that they're all working, go on to Device, Game Controllers, Properties, then open this up. So as you can see, if I turn the wheel, the full way this way, it will go that way. And this way here, this just lets you make sure that everything's working here. And that's like so. And then if you press on the gear stick, one of the red buttons, you may hear it, but there is the wheel spinning. Like so. So yeah. And you can te test your accelerator, your brake, and your clutch. So there's loads of things here, guys. Even your first gear, second gear, third gear, fourth gear, fifth gear, sixth gear, and finally your reverse gear. So that is basically all you need to know for setting this up. So the next video I will do 
on the setup for the G27, it will be Euro Truck Simulator 2. So if you want, if you don't know how to set up your G27 with Euro Truck Simulator, I will have a video about that up tomorrow. So check on the channel, or I'm, I'll maybe even have a link in the description by the time I've got that one up. There'll be a link in the description for it. Or if not, just go and check the channel and it will be there. Anyway guys, hopefully you've enjoyed watching. If so, please do hit that like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I will see you in the next video that I do. Thank you for watching and goodbye.